Hello friends and supporters. Randy and I wanted to take this opportunity to connect with you all before the end of this turbulent year. As I'm sure you're all aware, 2020 presented some very unique challenges for all of us due to the COVID-19 pandemic. And nonprofits in particular really felt the effects of this crisis. The Looking Out Foundation experienced a huge decline in donations as we sadly but temporarily lost the galvanizing platform of live music. But in spite of all this, in response to the civil rights movement sparked by the murders of George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, Elijah McClain, and countless others, LOF donated $250,000 to racial justice organizations this year. We also donated over $150,000 to families who were severely impacted by the pandemic through our COVID-19 relief program. But unfortunately, due to an unprecedented demand for help, we were overwhelmed with applications for assistance to the point where reluctantly we had to suspend our COVID-19 relief program back in October. But the need for financial assistance is stronger than ever as families continue to struggle with our adequate access to the resources they need to get through this pandemic. People are still losing their jobs and their homes and families with small children are facing the harsh reality of not knowing where their next meal is going to come from. In light of all this, we are working really hard to raise enough funds to make our COVID-19 relief program available again. So please text LOF to 443-21, 443-21, to help us continue to support underserved communities during this extraordinary time of need. Now, I know this holiday season is gonna be hard for a lot of us. We're all missing our loved ones. It's been a really tough year, and it's gonna be a very long winter. So in the spirit of the Looking Out Foundation, we're asking you all to really just look out for one another, stay connected with your community, be kind to yourselves, and be kind to one another. Our New Year's wish is that 2021 will bring us all safely back together again. And until then, Brandy and I are wishing you all a very happy and hopeful holiday season. Thank you.